All living things are made up of four classes of large biological molecules: carbohydrates, lipids, proteins, and nucleic acids. A polymer is a long molecule consisting of many similar building blocks, known as monomers. Carbohydrates, proteins, and nucleic acids are all polymers, whereas lipids are not true macromolecules because the monomers are not covalently bonded together. The monomers of carbohydrates are monosaccharides. With molecular formulas that are usually multiples of CH2O, glucose shown here is the most common monosaccharide. Monosaccharides are linked by glycosidic linkages to form disaccharide with two monomers and polysaccharides with three or more monomers. Functions of carbohydrates include energy storage, structural support, and cell recognition. Lipids are the one class of large biological molecules that do not form polymers. Their unifying feature is having little or no affinity for water. A fatty acid consists of a carboxyl group attached to a long carbon skeleton. Fats are constructed from glycerol and fatty acids connected by ester linkages. Lipids functions in energy storage, membrane structure, and acting as hormones. Proteins account for more than fifty percent of the dry mass of most cells. They are made of monomers known as amino acids. Which consists of a central carbon connected to a hydrogen atom, a carboxyl group, an R group side chain that differentiates each amino acid. An amino group. Amino acids are linked by peptide bonds into dipeptides and polypeptides. Proteins are used for enzyme structure, hormones, receptors, transport, immunity, motor, and storage. The last type of macromolecules called nucleic acids are made up of monomers called nucleotides. Each nucleotide consists of a nitrogenous base, a pentose sugar, and a phosphate group. Nucleotides are linked by phosphodiester bonds. Nucleic acids functions in the storage of genetic information, structural support, and catalysis. A dehydration or a condensation reaction removes a water molecule, forming a new bond between a monomer and a short polymer, leading to the synthesis of a longer polymer. This is known as anabolism, or constructing molecules from smaller units. Polymers are disassembled to monomers by hydrolysis, which adds a water molecule to break a bond. This is known as catabolism, a pathway that breaks down molecules into smaller units. The most common monosaccharides include glucose, fructose, and galactose. The most common disaccharides include sucrose, which is a glucose molecule linked to a fructose molecule. And lactose, which is a glucose molecule linked to a galactose molecule. There are two main types of polysaccharides. Homopolysaccharides contain only a single type of monomers, whereas heteropolysaccharides contain two or more different kinds of monomers. Homopolysaccharides that functions in energy storage include glycogen in animals, which consists of glucose linked by alpha one to four and alpha one to six. Starch are the energy storing polysaccharide found in plants. It also consists of alpha one to four and alpha one to six linkages of glucose. Structural homopolysaccharides include cellulose that consists of beta linkages of glucose. The enzymes in humans' digestive system can only hydrolyze alpha linkages and can't hydrolyze beta linkages. Therefore, cellulose in human food passes through the digestive tract as insoluble fiber. Chitin is another structural polysaccharide that is found in the exoskeleton of arthropods and the cell walls of many fungi, which consists of beta linkages of N-acetylglucosamine. Structural heteropolysaccharides include peptidoglycan, which is found in bacterial cell wall, and agar, which is found in seaweed and algae. Another class of heteropolysaccharides are found in the extracellular matrix. They are known as glucosaminoglycans. It includes hyaluronate, heparin, heparin sulfate, chondroitin sulfate, dermatin sulfate, and keratin sulfate. There are three main classes of lipids. Compound lipids include phospholipids, glycolipids, and sphingolipids, which usually consist of a hydrophilic head and hydrophobic tails. They are key components to our cell membrane. Simple lipids include wax and fatty acids. Derived lipids include. Cholesterol, which is an important steroid, which are lipids characterized by a carbon skeleton consisting of four fused rings.
Cholesterol is also an important part of the membrane. Many steroids also function as hormones, such as testosterone and estrogens. Isoprenoids are derived from 5-carbon compound isoprene. Isoprenoids have diverse functions, including fat-soluble vitamins, electron carrier, and pigments. Saturated fatty acids have the maximum number of hydrogen atoms possible and no double bonds. Most animal fats are saturated and are solid at room temperature. Unsaturated fatty acids have one or more double bonds. They are found in plants and fish and are usually liquid at room temperature. Natural unsaturated fatty acids usually consist of cis double bonds. The process of hydrogenation which converts unsaturated fats to saturated fats can also create unsaturated fats with trans double bond, which may contribute to cardiovascular disease through plaque deposits. Proteins are typically made out of 20 common amino acids. It consists of four levels of structure. The primary structure refers to the sequence of the amino acid linked by peptide bonds. The secondary structure results from hydrogen bonds between repeating constituents of the polypeptide backbone. The tertiary structure is formed by the interactions between R groups, and the quaternary structure results when two or more polypeptide chains form one macromolecule. All proteins have tertiary structures, but not all proteins have quaternary structures. In globular proteins, hydrophobic amino acids are usually buried in the center, whereas hydrophilic amino acids are located on the surface, being in contact with the aquatic environment. There are two main types of nucleotides. Pyrings include guanine and adenine, and pyrimidine includes cytosine, uracil, and thymine. Guanine base pair with cytosine and adenine base pair with uracil or thymine. There are two main types of nucleic acids, RNA or ribose nucleic acids and DNA or deoxyribose nucleic acid. They differ in the two prime position of the sugar and the nucleotide uracil is found in RNA, whereas the nucleotide thymine is found in DNA. RNAs also tend to be single-stranded, whereas DNAs tend to be double-stranded. There are three main types of RNAs, messenger RNA, transfer RNA, and ribosomal RNA, which are involved in transcription and translation. The DNA structure involves antiparallel double helix.